another awesome camera comparison video. This is Pixel 4 XL versus iPhone 13 Pro Max. Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. Welcome and welcome back to Gadget Rev Now. Pixel 4 XL is almost two and a half years old now, but still a really good camera phone. Well, iPhone 13 Pro Max is one of the best camera phones today with superb video recording capability. Two great phones in different generations. Let's do this. Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. We're starting with the audio test. We're outside near the road, so you can hear the background noise. So check one, two, three, check one, two, three. This is the sound that's coming out of Pixel 4 XL. And check one, two, three, check one, two, three. This is the sound that's coming out of iPhone 13 Pro Max. All right, let's begin our old champ versus new champ comparison video. On the audio side, iPhone 13 Pro Max is clearer and louder. So iPhone 13 Pro Max is the winner here. On our first image test, color profile and saturation, I check all photos on a bigger screen and here I just noticed that iPhone 13 Pro Max is generally brighter than Pixel 4 XL. There's also a difference in white balance, warmer on Pixel 4 XL and cooler on iPhone 13 Pro Max. So my impression here is because of the computational photography of Pixel 4 XL, it is well rounded and controlled while iPhone 13 Pro Max is brighter because of the bigger sensor and the f1.5 aperture that lets in more light. Almost the same look, the sky on iPhone 13 Pro Max is saturated and sometimes crushing the blacks a little bit. This is a personal preference, so it's a tie for me. Next, we want to check who manages the highlights better and here almost the same. Again, noticing a difference in white balance, warmer on Pixel 4 XL and cooler on iPhone 13 Pro Max. In some situation or scenarios, Pixel 4 XL will stand out as it controls the highlights better and showing more information on the brighter areas. Pixel 4 XL is the winner here. Next is 4K video recording in 30 FPS. Great colors on Pixel 4 XL, but because of the stabilization, it is zoomed in. While iPhone 13 Pro Max is brighter, smoother, and has a wider field of view, I like the iPhone 13 Pro Max better. Next is flaring, and I love how Pixel 4 XL controls the flaring. Here the right side of the tree on iPhone 13 Pro Max is a little washed out. Here do you see the blue dot in the middle of the image on iPhone 13 Pro Max. Pixel 4 XL remove it and replace it with a color that will blend well with the clouds. So Pixel 4 XL is the winner here. Next is closed focus. So if you look at the lower part of both images, Pixel 4 XL is sharper at the bottom. It has a closer focus compared to iPhone 13 Pro Max. This is the ultra wide camera of iPhone 13 Pro Max in 4K at 30 FPS. Perfect for vlogging. If you like this type of camera comparison video, don't forget to subscribe. Next, we're moving down to full HD at 30 FPS, and the video stabilization and panning is so much better on Pixel 4 XL. While iPhone 13 Pro Max maintained that great look, it is brighter, and the stabilization is great too. Next is exposure, so again, tendencies, iPhone 13 Pro Max tends to crush the blacks a little bit in replacement of better contrast. In terms of dynamic range, the HDR photos of Pixel 4 XL is showing its class here, not bad for an almost 3-year-old phone. Next is tech sharpness, and I think because of the bigger sensor of iPhone 13 Pro Max, it has a little bit of fringing and makes the text less sharper. Well, in terms of details, Pixel 4 XL is more detailed. iPhone 13 Pro Max tends to smoothen the images. Next, we're moving to selfie video recording. I don't like the selfie recording of Pixel 4 XL. It's only 1080p and a little soft for my taste. While iPhone 13 Pro Max has 4K and can go up to 60 FPS, colors are better and it's bright. Stabilization is great too. This is not portrait mode, but just to flex the bigger sensor of iPhone 13 Pro Max, it produces a natural looking background blur. Portrait mode on non-human subject, almost the same. I don't see any marginal difference. Let's start with the selfie portrait, not much difference. I guess a little bit more detailed on iPhone 13 Pro Max. Using the rear camera, Pixel 4 XL is a little bit zoom in on portrait mode, so it makes more sense to shoot on iPhone 13 Pro Max on arm's length. 
Images on Pixel 4 XL is a little bit more detailed while it is brighter on iPhone 13 Pro Max. Here I just love the images on Pixel 4 XL, true to life and more detailed on my wife's face. In low light, iPhone 13 Pro Max will produce a brighter portrait shots. Almost the same, I like the wider field of view of iPhone 13 Pro Max, but I love the portrait shots of Pixel 4 XL in terms of details and colors. Next is low light video recording on selfie mode. Um, I don't see any difference, both are noisy, but I think iPhone 13 Pro Max provide more information on darker areas. While on rear camera video recording, Pixel 4 XL has this weird bluish or purplish tone, while iPhone 13 Pro Max is just great. It shows more information and colors are spot on. Next is low light images, the newer sensor of iPhone 13 Pro Max is better in terms of noise reduction and the lens controls the flaring better. While Pixel 4 XL has a better exposure and white balance, I don't know why iPhone 13 Pro Max is super warm and yellowish here. Yikes. iPhone 13 Pro Max also has cinematic video, here's a quick look of Pixel 4 XL's regular video. And this is iPhone 13 Pro Max cinematic video. This is pretty impressive. And lastly, versatility. Both has regular white and zoom. iPhone 13 Pro Max has 3 times optical zoom compared to the 2 times of Pixel 4 XL, and it also has a wide angle camera, so iPhone 13 Pro Max is the winner here. So what is Gadget Revenant's verdict? Pixel 4 XL or iPhone 13 Pro Max? This is a great battle, the old champ versus the new champ. Let's do a recap. Pixel 4 XL manages the highlights better, it has well-rounded colors, manages the flaring better, it has closer focus, better exposure, better dynamic range, texts are sharper, and more detailed. Well, the newer iPhone 13 Pro Max has better audio, more contrasty, produces brighter image, better 4K video recording, better 4K selfie video recording, wider field of view on portrait mode, natural background blur, better low light video capability, cinematic video, and has wide angle lens. Pixel 4 XL is a really good camera phone for phone photography. I think it is superior, but in video performance, iPhone 13 Pro Max is the best out there. And there you go. Hope you enjoyed this video. I will continue to compare these two phones in our channel, so stay tuned. And as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.